Hello and welcome to Deus Ex. Okay, let's talk about character creator. So at first, a very important thing is to downgrade pistols. This gives you bonus point and pistol will be trained to uh, uh, to train automatically. It's exploit, but it's very fun exploit. Anyway, let's talk about computer. Computer skill basically allow you to hack ATM machines and other shits. It's uh, one of the most important skills in the game. You should always invest. In my opinion, it is very worth it to invest two points here. Because uh, at two points, advance allow you to uh, hijack gun turrets. And the gun turrets have two setups. Uh, they either attack enemies or attack you. And you rather make them attack enemies. Uh, second, we have electronics. Electronics is also a very important skill. You should consider having it trained from the very start. It allows you to bypass electronic devices, some uh, electric traps, and there is a lot of them. Open some doors, bypass terminals if you don't have code. It's a really important and relevant skill in the game. Can't go wrong with it. Any fear of mental training is rather useless. You have augmentation that basically work like environmental training. And you have switch that last uh, long enough to sustain without it. Lockpicking. Lockpicking is another most important skill in the game. Uh, it's uh, slightly worse than electronics. This is why I basically don't train it uh, in the first mission. But you can, it's, it's a very good skill. You should train it right after first mission or even in first mission if you prefer. Medicine, medicine is good skill, it's relevant, it's practical, can't go wrong. Uh, swimming is a relatively interesting skill because it's not useless. I would say, because it's increased uh, swimming speed underwater, I would argue that train it in swimming is not a bad idea. But I'm not going to do it. Demolition. Uh, honestly, I have no fucking idea why would you ever go with demolition. Because you see, it increased the uh, strength of grenades. And it's allow you to easier disarm them, but you don't need to be trained. Untrained agent can do everything with demolition that trained agent can do. It's not really a big deal to not train the skill for the entire game, it's rather useless. Heavy, okay. Heavy weapons are interesting because this uh, this basically allow you to run with guns uh, that are heavy, which is very practical. And speedrunners might like this skill, but uh, for casual player, I would argue that you don't need the skill. You can, but yeah, I'm using heavy weapons all the time. Flamethrower don't miss and flames kills, uh, like uh, if you train or not train, they are deadly as well. So, wh why bother? Mm, Gap rocket deal 3000, 300 damage. So, I do, I'm not sure if there is a benefit, if that will deal more damage. Accuracy and damage increase with re reloading and movement is somehow faster. Yeah, reloading and movement is very. Good idea, but you don't, don't care, really. Low-tech weapon. Low weapon are great. Uh, for low-tech weapon is every melee weapon in the game. And some prods and some, uh, you know, some of the spats paper sprays, for example. Uh, so basically, low-tech weapons are great. And best sword in the game is also low-tech, despite being uh, basically lightsaber. Uh, and being able to one hit everyone. Uh, it's very good idea to be trained in low tech. Very good skill overall, I would recommend it. Pistol. Uh, pistol is your basic skill, like uh, what can I say? Handguns, uh, always find ammo. Uh, later in the game, it's very hard to find hand uh, find pistol, by the way. Pistols also work for crossbow, it's rather handgun skill. I would highly suggest to like have it. You will have it trained if you play on this version. If you play on community update, you will suck. And I would recommend uh, having it trained. Add uh, the rifle. 
Okay, rifle is amazing skill. If you have master, sniper rifle can open some locks, which is absolutely fantastic. <sighs> Otherwise, a sniper rifle doesn't really require training here to be useful. I would say to basically go with your guts. You can go good with swimming and medicine on one. Basically every single skill put to train is not a bad idea. However, you should specialize because game highly rewards specialization. And I would say if you wanna specialize, never go beyond advanced in computers. Advanced give you hacking turrets, master doesn't really give you anything. Electronic advance is pretty relevant because you take 40 for every electronic uh, bypasser instead of 25. And now on train you take 25. M medicine is relevant, train is probably all you need, but you don't really need medicine because you can eat candy bars or other shit you find around to regenerate HP. It's not great idea to regenerate HP with food. But it's better idea than, you know, dying, for example. And since food is everywhere, why, why not just, you know, uh, save medkits for uh, harder occasions? Medicine naturally allow you to preserve medkits, but... If you max rifle or max, max pistol, basically damage skills in any form, you should be good to go. So I would say to max or at least uh, heavily invest in uh, two skills you like, for example low, low tech and rifle or low tech pistol. I would suggest to not go demolition at all, maybe one, one level just, just to have easier time disarming this shit, because honestly game can encourage you to save right before explosive. And that's it, you are pretty much good to go. Secondary unit should be online soon. Uh, secondary unit is yours. Primary unit is... My people will continue to report on How? its progress. Necessary, the primary will be terminated. We've had to endure much, you and I, but soon there will be order again. A new age. Aquinas spoke of the mythical city on the hill. Soon, that city will be a reality. And, and this is probably our character. Are better than kings. Gods. This uh, this entire dialogue is very confusing and not not informative for a new player. I don't know why they made that play. Honestly, I don't feel stable FPS as we did. I am experimenting with this rendering and Not so fast, JC. Talk to your brother before leaving the dock. He has a map of the island. If you want to make a covert approach, remember the academy stuff. Stay out of their field of view, walk slowly to stay quiet, and crouch behind cover. Paul, oh, I thought you were in Hong Kong. Welcome to the coalition, JC. Fuck. I might as well start using your code name. Think I'd miss my brother's first day? Didn't think you'd have a choice. What's going on? The NSF. They hit one of our shipments. A few of them got away, but we trapped the rest in the statue. What are we waiting for? Looks like a textbook assault. The NSF took one of our agents hostage. The bots are holding the perimeter, but my orders are to hold back and send you in alone. I think someone high up wants to see how you handle the situation. Mm -hmm. All I've got with me is a pistol and an electric prod. I don't mind a test, but Yunako better issue some hardware. I want to leave. Please, stick with the prod. It'll stun your opponents or knock them unconscious. I will die. Not takedown is always the most silent way to eliminate resistance. Just in case, though, Manderly wants you to pick an additional weapon. A sniper rifle, a gap gun, or a mini crossbow. Mm. Never know when I might come up against some heavy armor. Give me the gap gun. The gap gun might be useful. They have a security This is the best choice you can make entrance. early in the game. Great. What's the first move? I'm going to give you a map of the island. If you can get to the north dock, you just control, don't use it. By the way, if this is locked, he responds to the code phrase "iron and copper." You could avoid a lot of fighting, though, if you found a back way to the statue. I'll see how it looks on shore. Your primary objective is the makeshift command center the terrorists have installed at the top of the statue, but don't forget about Agent Herman. We think he's being held on the ground floor. What are my orders when I reach the command center? Interrogate the leader. 
We don't yet know why the terrorists would risk an open assault. I can't move. They instantly decapitated my leg. That was brutal, by the way. Gap can take a lot of inventory space, so some players might don't like it. I would say don't don't care. You can pick a lot of skill points in early missions. I'm not sure if I'm capable of playing it right now. I just wanted to briefly mention uh, uh, things about character creator. By the way, gain heavily reward exploration. Okay, I think uh, this direct ten rendering works for me. It's not perfect, but it works. We go here because you see, game was created with intention to give uh, every build a uh, chance in in play. Bioelectric cell. This will be relevant later. For now, we only have. What's your take on the situation, Corporal? The bots have them bottled up, sir. We'd go right in if it weren't for the whole back order. How'd they get one of our agents? Wilter went rogue on us. When the order came, we wouldn't pull back. Now you get to bail him out. Yeah, you can ask people around. It's always worth to take additional dialogue. I wonder if you can help it here. Yeah, by the way, uh, we are running slower because as I decided to decapitate my own legs. Because Okay, idea to decapitate my own legs wasn't very bright from me. I am... Uh, I can agree. But you have to understand that That was simply a consequence of my own action. You think you have a, 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 a weapon? I love using my fans to deal with my problems. Check this out. He is wounded, by the way. He will no, no longer fight me if I will approach him, which is very relevant. Uh, that guy that died, uh, he sells tranquilizer darts, so it's not likely now. If it had consequences, I wanted to buy these darts. <laughs> this is why I looted crossbow. <laughs> Wait, maybe you are backup guy. Welcome aboard, agent. No, you are not backup guy. I hate this. Uh, it's good. Yeah, game reward exploration, as I briefly mentioned that, but I maybe will be able to demonstrate it. 
this key for example you usually by key is one of the most useful item in the game you can lock and unlock the doors which is also relevant as you see 50 exploration bonus this is nothing but this is my nothing and i take it you later get password to this but it's zero 451 and there are tranquilizer dots I would naturally don't have to use this password if it wasn't be uh, for, for <laughs> a few inconveniences that I encountered let's just say I planned this <laughs> to go more smoothly but it's good I, I have a lot of fun Having two functional legs allow you to run. With one I was just kind of skipping. Oh, by the way, uh, this is a freshly installed game. So you, you wanna toggle crunch to be enabled and keyboard mouse. Here you wanna have it on control and maybe on X if you like this. Uh, X is default. Mm. Toggle wall crown, great. Yes, wall crown shift. You also wanna have reload. Reload is somewhere. Honestly, this deactivate all augmentation is not, not stupid. It's a much better idea to just crowbar them. I mean, naturally, killing them is always easier than, you know, not killing them. Be careful. The NSF has set up patchwork security systems here. The NSF put a commercial grade security bot in this area. You can either avoid its patrol route or, if you're feeling lucky, try and take it out with the EMP grenades or explosives. I wouldn't recommend taking it on with small arms. You wanna hack the wall, there is sniper. On realistic sniper, one shot everything. It all happened an hour. Is to run. The barge dock and the NSF take box. Offloading the car to the snowers. Our undercover man Harley Philbin should be somewhere out on the docks now. Yeah, I love doing it like this because it's fun. This bot automatically patrols here and will detect any hostile activities. Any moment now. Pacifist. Look at this pacifist. Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah, very good. Okay, so far I batoned one person and never harmed anybody otherwise. Rockets for gap gun, that's great. This is TNT. TNT is one of the best items in this game. This is your secondary objective. Talk to this guy. About time you showed up. Iron and copper. The statue is copper on an iron frame, right? Password's enough, pal. Don't think you know something about the lady I don't. My dad did tours out here. I heard that you can get me inside. Depends. 
You get your man out, take back the statue, whatever. But I know the commander and I don't want to see him get hurt. Here's a picture so you don't make a mistake. Mm -hmm. You can trust me. I'll take your word. Here's the key to the front entrance. Commander's not much of a soldier. He'll surrender as soon as he sees you. I need him alive because he's my main contact at the NSF. By the way, by not doing he's secondary goal, much of a business. Thanks. game is much easier in this mission. You can literally sneak past everything. You with Philbin? I get a cut for bringing him over. Tell me what you know about the NSF operation. I'm not that high level. The more elite troops, they're the ones that took over the ship and unloaded it into speedboats. She doesn't look very we're good. we're supposed to be a diversion. The ship? That's all I know. The commander gave me a 10mm clip, a box of 30 out 6 ammo, and some crossbow darts, and said keep your head down. Huh. Like I'm gonna take on your NATCO troops. Wanna? You can have the clip for 175, the 30 out 6 for 300, and the darts for 50. But if I was you, I'd avoid a head-on attack altogether and not even use the key Philbin got. I'd go in the statue from the back. Less security that way. Uh, so we take three or three hundred. Give me the thirty out six ammo. Thanks. This is sniper rifle ammo. We naturally don't have sniper rifle, but it's a good a good choice. Soda. Uh, you should drink the stuffs like sodas because they restore HP and we don't have much because we play like more. Okay. This is problematic because here is an exploration bonus. Fuck, take it. Okay, I wanna have good view of where I dive and that's why I pre-activated. Okay, and we are doing sniper rifle run probably, or at least we will heavily invest into sniper rifle. Yeah, that is much better for survival in this mission to have an uh, HP remaining. As for TNT, uh, where to use it? Uh, here are a few areas where you can plant TNT. This guy is too far for now, but this is a sniper. If you manage to use tranquilizer dart, That was shot from sniper rifle. You wanna run very fast. Okay. Very good. Um. And now inventory. Yes, you don't have sp slots in inventory to pick up sniper and this is very bad. This basically means 
You are doing something wrong. Cigarettes are useless. You cannot sell them to anybody. Nobody wants to have them. He's unconscious, as you can see. But this is sniper rifle, one of the best weapons in the game. And we have weapon modification. Accuracy, weapon modification, reload. We are extremely fucking bad with using these weapons. Oh, by the way, these are my skills. As I promised, pistol is, is trained automatically. Low tech is trained because I choose it. And we have electronic and computer. You can not have lockpick skill and still lockpick a lot. It's just value of lockpicks. Uh, how uh, how useful single lockpick will be for you is determined by lockpick skill. Best usage for crossbow is to basically shoot it once and run away. It's ba basically worst weapon in the game, even if you land headshot. One of the good strategies against these guys is to prod them. But You don't have to play as pacifist or... Game as pacifist is much, much harder. Okay. He literally walked towards this laser. Now this allow you to go here and use tool. This have strength 10 because 10% is probably how much untrained agent drain from this. I have no idea why, why he walked into it, but it's not my kill and that's important. Here you can get info, login SSF, password smash the state. I love this password, by the way. It's fantastic. You can do this. Hmm. Weapon modification clip. Weapon modification laser. I don't know if laser does anything. But <laughs> man, <laughs> oh fuck! Okay, okay, easy, 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 easy. Yeah, and that way you save tool for another mission. It's relatively useful to preserve items you don't have to use, but. It's not mandatory. You can always find additional resources by exploring.
Hazmat helps with environmental hazards, but we jump around them. Box is one of the best items in the game. You can basically do a lot in this game by using boxes. Ladder back, naturally. And we are on top. Honestly, I didn't... Knocking out or killing enemies in this level give you their loot. But if you finish them up, they will be killed automatically. However, they will be also looted automatically. As you might notice, I see him through the box, and I know where he is. One of the reasons why we are sneaking instead of sprinting is because uh, it was too close. Second reason is because naturally my HP is zero, because I play like idiot. But you don't need to play very good. Like, if you if you can see my amazing gameplay, you probably can notice that you don't really need to play good in this game to have fun. Okay, this is uh, like important because. I don't know how to a quick save. But we wanna save. And the reason why we save here is because we will be uh, having hard task of disarming explosive. Without skills. This one. Okay, that was crucial for success of this operation. Uh, where is that con console? Here. How likely I am to go there? Uh, not likely, really. Not, not even worth it. Uh, yeah, we can save here because we will be basically traveling with this stupid box. Uh, you should not use medkits in this in this unless you have re literally decapitated legs like I had before. And if you are afraid and feel like you like seen a notch, you can go right and finish the mission. But you can also go left. Did I find the shipment? Yeah, we got the whole supply. You can see the ship's lights crossing the bay. Mm. 
Okay, and this is most crucial point of operation. It is vital. I don't have legs anymore. I need to uh, keep using prod because I'm too weak in take those skills to pull them off. I think Hunter is being held behind this laser trigger alarm. If you don't want to set off the alarm, you can either hack the control panel in the doorway or find a way around. My blueprint of the statue shows a few air shafts. By the way, chances of hitting you here are extremely low. Stay cool, the guy's still around. Okay. Yeah, you should use food because it's useful to Regenerate HP. Un HP. Uh, even you know. Most remote chance. Holy shit, look at this. My torso HP. Oh. <laughs> We are drunk, by the way. It's also useful to use your stupid augmentation. <laughs> My vision is augmented. I was thinking why I keep crouching and I, I forgot. My legs don't fucking exist anymore. You can't jump in this, uh, this situation, not really. Okay, I I never had was in so bad shape in this in this place by the way. So I'm kind of uh, I'm trying to find myself yet. It's not my optimum. Usually I had max HP here. But of course, when you're trying to record video, it's always You know, you see your skill is slightly lower and now you are on copium naturally because you have to excuse your fucking terrible performance somehow.
patience in this game is rewarding. Doesn't matter. Nothing. I guess we're safe. Only reason why I save here is because. Wait, I have knife, I have knife, okay. Roger not her, Agent. Command should not have left us to be surrounded. Risk is part of the job. I think he left out this time. And sadly, I wanna priority to go in, but for no reason to send pull back. I do not retreat. Please give me a weapon and move on the line. As you wish. Take my pistol. That may be adequate. I will secure the cell. You proceed up the stairs to the command center at the top. I am not ready to face a shot in the back. Yeah, as you saw, I basically did have no HP or that or what so fucking ever. We will drink this wine. Accuracy for my sniper rifle. Decent. Pistol. Ammo. I think he yoink my ammo for pistol. Or not. Do I have full ammo or I, I have some petty numbers? I think I have full ammo. Good. Oh, this is Faucet. I, I was hoping it's something. So, what Gunter kills uh, counts as lootable by the player. I think Gunter is somewhere on this level, like he promised to be, and he's currently clearing this guy. I blame Gunter because I don't know where he is. These guys will never hurt you. They currently wanna leave. Oh, this is a very rare mechanic in games. But your enemies can sometimes run for their survival. In those decks it's notorious mechanic. They, naturally, they can outrun me because I don't have legs, <laughs> which is quite pathetic if you ask me. If you are super desperate, you can heal yourself here. It will take some time, but I, I honestly never bothered. But 
Yeah. We have a password of that some guy that we stole. Yeah, they, they never attack me because their HP is too low right now for them to attempt anything like this. So technically they are not tranquilized or sleep or dead, but they are also harmless to me, so it's nice. You can create this state for them by, like for example, launching a knife on, uh, on them or something like this. By the way, there are a few enemies of Gebgan advice to, you know, don't advise it to no players because it's not super useful early. But as you saw at that ship uh, earlier, it was pretty good. <sighs> yeah, he will spam your fucking transmissions. Yeah, I would like to reach command post, but I want to save to be safe. When you have uh, like functional legs, you can sneak by these guys. Let's get out of here. I'm standing my ground. Someone took the alarm downstairs. They're closing in. This is it, Private. We knew it might come to this. What good are we to the NSF if we end up dead? If you not code reach the perimeter, then it's already too late. Get ready to fight. Yeah, with my current health, I'm sure I'm most threatening force in the world. Don't shoot! I surrender! So you think you know better than FEMA what to do with this month's Ambrosia shipment? You're too late. It's on its way back to the people, and you can't do a damn thing about it. Mm-hmm. Tell me about the shipment, and I'll order troops to pick you up as a prisoner instead of a corpse. Ask away. We already won this round. That's true. We're just giving ordinary, ordinary people the same chance to survive the bureaucrats in Washington. You'll have to unload New York because the chopper is you at sea. I think the government made the play on purpose to get rid of the population growth. Well done. I will pass on your orders to the troopers. Report back to base on the west side of the island. Mission complete. You can talk to him if you want. Thank you, soldier. You did great. And that will be it for first mission. As once you report in UNATCO, you should have an option to lockpick for your second mission. Just answer the question. Don't believe me. It's all in the numbers. For a hundred years, there's been a conspiracy of ludicrous against ordinary people. You have a single fact to back that up. Number one, in 1945, corporations paid 50% of federal taxes. Now they pay about 5%. Number two, in 1900, 90% of Americans were self employed. Now it's about 2%. So, it's called consolidation. Strengthen governments and corporations, weaken individuals. With taxes, it can be done imperceptibly over time. That's true, basically. I guarantee you that the interrogation staff of Yanko will not be as far as I am. Yeah, the stupid police. 
You just, just bullets, bullets for a completely, completely illegitimate, illegitimate government in Washington. We will we'll locate that ship, ship in one way or another. The entire executive branch is handpicked. Nineteen of the last twenty-three U.S. presidents have been members of the Trilateral Commission. The Trilateral Commission is financed by the Rockefellers and the Rothschilds. Don't tell me. That's a think tank. Anyone can become a member. But not everyone does. That's why they call it the secret government. You can't fight ideas with books. Did you ever ask what it's for? The surveillance? The police? The shooting of sight laws? Is that freedom? Yeah, shoot on sight is pretty wild. So we don't have anything uh, to really. Uh, we have flare that I never use. Uh, on my way, crawling back to you, not like a fucking dog I am. Yes. So mission it was great, by the way. It was okay. That was like. A worse perfect, if I can say in that. Like, almost perfect, excluding my wants. But we achieved everything, we have all the bonuses. We didn't kill anybody. So we basically meet all uh, like all basic requirements of this mission to be fully successful. <laughs> we also find uh, key weapons. And well, I have no idea why they targeted my legs so fucking cruelly. But they did. That's... <sighs> That's a problem. We'll be saving uh, for... Grenades. Here. Oh, I'm so happy... To have this arm safe. Otherwise I would have to repeat everything. <laughs> As for taking it versus not taking it. Hmm. I would argue for the start it's better to not take it. Because if you would not crawl, taking it would be a better idea. But since my legs don't exist... Which is a problem, by the way.
Okay, this is a problem. They sent us in to pick up the pieces. We've already searched the box and delivered the enemy munitions to the quartermaster. Yeah, so people you don't uh, hit or kill basically ends as ammunition for Quartermaster, which means you waste this loot, kind of. If that's the term. This guy has paper gun. I never use paper gun, but it's good. You can, if you, if you are like quick, uh, you can disarm like f multiple enemies and quickly uh, use batons on them. You wanna have low tech uh, trained if you wanna use batons at all. Otherwise, it will be absolutely impossible to render anybody unconscious with it. Don't worry about the bodies. We'll handle the thing now. Okay, I wanna make safe here. Honestly, I... I never was in so bad shape here before. Patience is very important in this game. I didn't know you can, uh, from crouching, you can trigger TNT. I never did that before. Uh, my experience with having dead legs and crouching is absolutely like low. I mean, I know you can do it from height, but that requires you to stand on high grounds. Wait, you can talk to Paul. We've got the island secured. How did things look in the statue? The leader surrendered. So they were after Ambrosia. A month's supply for the East Coast. We think they've taken it back to the city. I didn't know UNATCO handled the Ambrosia distribution. Manderly will brief us shortly. UNATCO makes sure the limited supply of vaccine gets to government agencies and key industries. It's good to finally see some action. Just keep a level head. You're doing well so far. Now okay. get inside. I'll meet you in Manderly's office, level two. Get inside. I'll meet you in Manderly's office. Get inside. I'll meet you in Manderly's office. This is only talk you have? Get inside. I'll meet you in Manderly's office. Garbage. Hmm. So if you in first time when you meet Paul and if he gives you Gebgan, talk to him more. You will have go, more dialogue. Oh, you wanna have space for these candy bars, by the way. It's my first day too. I'm pretty excited. I was, I was in your class at the academy. academy. You, probably you probably don't remember. Don't remember. Yeah, voices and quotes from these games are iconic. Check in with Manderly on level 2. Do I have an ouch for a lockpick, by the way? No. Very, very close, but no. United Nation Anti-Terrorist Coalition. Come on in. The retinal scanner can be blood vessel 
as well keep your sunglasses. Oh man. Do not do stupid shit. It's explosives. Remember that Mr. Manderly wants to see you. Because they are fucking deadly. His secretary, Janice Reed, has your login and password. Do not do any stupid shit with explosives. We finally got the cats and rebels, eh, Denton? Hell of a first day. Yeah, you are not go. Yeah, let's drop this box and let's go. Reporting for duty, sir. The man himself. Splendid. Do you accept my apologies about the situation topside? A refreshing change from the captain, sir. Don't despise dreaming, my boy. Even you would be worthless without the ship in touch with drills and studies. So the NSF took a ship in the Ambrosia vaccine? Give me a chopper and a pilot and I'll handle it. I'm sure you could. Yes, indeed. But you're having your brother head up with the cover team. You'll work with Agent Anna Navarra. Why don't we meet when you've seen Amy for our medical checkup and received your equipment from Santa Carter? You'll be briefed at that time. Yes, sir. Hmm. Honestly? You've got to see Carter and Reyes before Mandalay can brief you. Yeah, but you also wanna see Anna right now. Because you might miss your conversation with her. Are you sure you pressed the right button? I do not make mistakes at that time. Your hand might have slipped. No, I wanted an orange. It gave me lemon lime. The machine would not make a mistake. It's the maintenance man. He knows I like orange. So you think the staff has some kind of plot? Yes, they do that on purpose. My new partner, J.C. Benton. Don't tell me you're going to wear your sunglasses or in a makeup wash. My vision is augmented. At least it is a way that we know when it's not hollow. Forgive my interruption. I just wanted to say that I look forward to working with you, Agent Navarro. Could you tell me how to find Anna's office? I do not expect you to perform as well as Agent Herman, but the mission will require us to do more than frighten the NSF with our baggy coats that make us look bigger than we really are. He will not be the equivalent of his brother. I have seen that he knows the procedure of a good offense. Let us help you are. I have to prepare for the mission. I'm sorry, just when she mentioned that bigger than we are. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in pain, okay. But it was so funny. There is ammo, of course I can't take it because I'm too small. This is my PC.
Yeah, I don't feel anything. So let's go. I have five lock picks and four multi tools. We will be throwing TNT left and right to avoid using lock picks. You can, by the way, stand on these ro robots and kill them that way, and they explode. That was a close one up there. I don't like getting shot at. Not one bit. Player can do something very unprofessional in ladies' restroom, <laughs> especially now with my current condition. Yeah, what you wanna do basically is go here. Go to health menu. And go this. <laughs> okay, here is your first important choice. This is arms. You can take only one upgrade in arms. Two in subdermals, which is everything under your skin. And three in torso. And here one of the choices is microfibral my, my muscle. It's uh, basically my brainlet. So go go for it. Uh, I think it consumes 20 units and it allows you to lift and push heavier objects when you activate it. I personally, it's not useless. It's best you can take. And I take this. Uh, which means I will be locked from the other upgrade that I said is most, more useful. Because it is more useful, you, you have to trust me on this one. Holy shit, I can finally throw things. Hey, JC, you look like the real thing. They actually let you operate on people. Just to jump those in fact. A sicky actuator. So far, I feel more like a mechanic than a doctor. I'm impressed. They actually let you point a gun at people. We'll have to catch up later. I've got to leave for New York right away. Can you send me whatever it is he wants? No problem. Listen, JC. About your augmentations. You know they're preparing to roll out the technology worldwide, right? As long as I don't turn green, you're a pair of antennas, as I understand it. Yeah, well, the design is pretty modular, which means you'll soon have access to upgrades from standard augmentation canisters. Great. Have anything for me? Not yet. But remember, if you find one of these canisters, then you need a med bar for installation. I'll do that. The canisters contain a carload of ROM modules. Some are generic upgrades, others require you to make permanent choices about how to configure one of your subsystems. It's about time that they implemented some of this stuff. Yeah, he informed me about things. One more thing go, since you've been briefed on my augmentations. What can you tell me about the info link? Let's see, micro receiver exostructure in the cell guide, mechanocarbon threads on the axons, procuring an old packet item. Anything particularly interests you? Is there a way to turn it off? The info link? Yeah, or someone at the Yakko tuned in 24 hours. These might sound a little funny, JC, but I'm not permitted to answer that question. <laughs> your clearance is higher than mine. Regarding your systems, I am your physician. No big deal, I was just curious. Cutters out the door and around the corner. He saw yourself this. Yeah. Carter offer you a stealth pistol. A stealth pistol is worst worst pistol in the game. You should absolutely not take it at all. You should drop it on the ground right in front of the Carter. Drink soda. Uh, take candy bar. Uh, candy bars will be used to. That was a close one up there. I don't like getting shot at. Not one bit. I absolutely understand. 
Whenever cat is able to give you some garbage, you can just drop get them. General Carter, I read about the Merced operation in school. This is a great honor. I'm not a general anymore. Just call me Carter. I can't believe what the NSF did to your family. Enough of that, soldier. We each have our troubles. I lost my children, but you had to grow up without your parents, which requires more. My parents died or accident. I said that's enough. That sounds fine. Thank you. What else do you think of me? Yeah, you should always ask about one of this. I just have dilemma about which one I I wanna take. I think I wanna take nanotech tool this time. Can you share a nanotech tech tool? A man who uses his head. I like that. Now move out. Manderly's waiting. So. He only gave us one item, but it's this pistol, and it's absolute trash. This is non-silenced pistol, and it deals 15 damage. His pistol deals 8 damage, so it's like fucking baton with the distance. <laughs> By the way, remember that the gap gun takedown <laughs> okay, you wanna save because bad throw and you trigger a lot of alarms or <laughs> or kill someone. But good throw. JC. Mind if I call you Absolutely no problem, my man. Yeah, this is why we took this all road to take this fucking shit. Forget how Agent Alpha is a friendly. She has every life to give for a partner. You should get moving. Yes, naturally. Yeah, two lockpicks, 10% one lockpick, that's uh, basically atrocious, no. Yeah, always upgrade lockpick to the one level. Okay, and also upstairs, there is a trick. I don't know uh, which cell... We finally got the cats and rattles there again. Yes, there is another uh, accuracy upgrade for your sniper rifle if you do sniper build. Or pistol, you can do pistol build if you want. Or you can go shotgun, I never did shotgun. Shotgun is rifle or what What type of uh, thing it is? Weapon rifle. That's great actually. Okay, you need to drop items. Tech googles are decent. Hazmat suite is decent. Knife is bad. Yeah, a crazy upgrade for my sniper. Perfect. Hell of a first day. Agree. Oh fuck, fuck. Wrong key. When door strength is infinite, you don't wanna use the rockets at all. But yeah, now the whenever they will entry. have ideas of locking these doors, you will have key. Didn't know the NSF had so many people in New York. 
You can now go out the side and properly function like a fucking human being with functional legs. We could also visit Mandeli and be briefed about new operation, but that would prevent me from exploration further. We don't have much exploration, by the way. I, I will show you last thing you, we do. It's my first here. day too. I'm pretty excited. I was in your class at the academy. You probably don't remember. We don't really have to like. Paul. Uh, Paul. Okay, game didn't predict me to get back here without talking to. They sent us in to pick up the pieces. We've already searched. Them. Yeah, so that guy normally sells items. I kind of regret he got killed that way. Kind of. No worry about the bodies. We'll handle it. Yeah, once you leave this area, will no longer be full accessible for you. Which is big problem in my opinion. But it's not super big problem, just big. Like I know to complain. Someone should have put a slug in the commander's hand. Yeah, my PC doesn't work very well with rendering and recording in this quality. Not to mention it's still fucking dark and I hope it will be brighter. I guess you're just following orders up there. Oh, okay, I see. You do not interact with bodies when you carry TNT. That's very important, apparently. Fuck, I don't see anything. But yeah, we got it. Perfect. You're going to make a mess. That will be JC's job. What's that? Power station. The NSF have Ambrosia in a warehouse protected by cameras and booby traps. We want to power down the whole system. We're taking one illicit generating plant, protected by weak groups of NSF. Knock out that plant, and Paul's team can walk right into the warehouse. Just tell me where it is. The NSF are openly resisting our deployed forces, gradually falling back. You have to deal with them first. And you be ready, Paul. When the power drops, go in and go in hard. I'll use my discretion. Go in like the U.S. Marshals. We lose the vaccine, I'm sending your bike to the mayor to explain why he and his three daughters won't get their pills this month. Yes, sir. Let's go waste some time, JC. Get down to the dock. A boat is waiting to take you and your partner and the bar to shore. Yes, get moving. Here's your op bonus for the great job you did in the statue. Plus 250 for rescuing Agent Herman. That's 1250. We take care of our people around here. Yeah. Thank you, sir. You'll come to admire your partner. She's one of our best. We'll meet up in this. Yeah, Anne is very strong, by the way. You can't really rely on her because she's kind of crazy, but strong. Uh, 
And we finally can see what is on my desk. Yeah, I need that walking and ability to travel. That was close up there. In men's bathroom you can find cigarettes and they will be removed from here in future visits. Oh, there is also one thing I forgot to do. Use this key. You have throwing knife, which is useful. Not very useful, but probably more useful than EMP nades. Yeah. No, 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 when you, you need EMP mates, I hate this. Okay, so this provides light amplification, which is bad because I rather use my, my augment. That is bad, too. Throwing knives are great, they can skip dialogues if you are speedrunner. If you're not speedrunner, they are still pain. I don't like getting shot at. Not one bit. Yeah, that's perfectly reasonable, man. Okay, we are deployed, we have our orders and we can go. This is the last time when you can buy ammo from that woman and we got to catch some rebels, eh, Dan? Hell of a first day. Yeah. You know, the NSF had so many people in New York. Wish I was going with you. Let's go. Good luck out there. Man, two dens in the field. The NSF won't know what hit him. I mentioned that I will try to take TNT and see if you can take TNT to this mission, right? Yeah, I did that, okay. Okay, let's do this. Me, TNT, and boat. I doubt it will be uh, like game will allow it, but it is within the spectrum of possibility. Holy shit, Collins! Good thing you catch it. Battery park. Yeah, battery park will be location you will be visiting like at least two times if we can count one one instance. Holy shit! Holy shit! Guys, I have good feeling about this. I don't think. A few have barricaded themselves inside Castle Clinton. Lead the way. Our order goes are to locate a barrel of ambrosia they are hiding inside. I will give you a schematic of the barrel, but first we will exterminate the NSF terrorists. Exterminate? A precious opportunity we cannot neglect. Mm -hmm. What about the rest of the ship? That is your brother's assignment. You will take the subway to meet him in his kitchen. But first, we should deal with Castle Clinton. Are we going to front or is there another way? A secondary entrance would be useful, but I am aware of no such thing. 
Yeah, she doesn't know who to get the secondary entrance. President Meade has declared a war emergency. Shook to kill. Yeah, there is one suspicious thing that you can unlock with lockpick. I wonder what that's for. You have your orders. <laughs> By the way, it's extremely useful to do this, go very fast, Yeah, I want the TNT box because yeah, they are extremely useful here. Unless you wanna use lockpicks, which you can. But why would you use lockpicks when you can use uh, magic TNT boxes of happiness? Then I wanna go rifles in this build. I should probably go rifles in this build. But I wanted to go pistol. There is one minimal problem with this kid. Because you would rather not use lockpicks on this chest. Yeah, they all have ammo for basic pistol. Hell of a long shift. We've got your back, Agent. The Ambrosia is somewhere inside. They won't get far if they try to escape. Yeah, your quest is to localize where is Ambrosia in this castle. Which is rather simple task. Don't let me get in your way, officer. That's true. Starving. Do you have anything to eat? All I have is a candy bar. Don't matter. I just need something in my stomach so I can fall asleep. Here you go. Do you have a place to stay? I sleep out on the dock where they unload the speedboats. Speedboats? Is that how the NSF get their supplies? I don't know. They're always coming in and out of the tunnel behind the sorting machine. Interesting. I spy on them from the crates. The code is 9183. Clever boy. Thanks for the snack, mister. It's the least I could do. That was good. Yeah. 
If you would have TNT box, you can absolutely deton detonate this shit. You can also not use TNT box and instead use gap gun. There is a ladder on this side, but it's kind of far. So now all basically exploration roads available for us. This, okay. You have great that, most likely. Anybody who is coaching, you can easily suspect of having uh, the play. So information about the code can be dig from this chest next to this boy that you can basically explode. However, as you may see, this boy is very close to this chest, so exploding it might not be a morally good choice. My advice, uh, so if you want to be very efficient, is the best uh, best way is to either uh, use one tool, one lockpick, or just know the code. Sadly, I'm metagamer, so I know the code. And this allows you to go here. Yes. I saw somebody. Now when you have Agent Navara Oh wait, this guy, this thing 
You don't wanna. Fuck. So, your goal right now would be to lead Agent Navara into a trap. If you wanna do it in my in my methods, which are extremely crude. I had to step back because I need unit connivements. Yeah, I noticed. Fuck, 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 fuck. If I can be perfectly honest, normally they are not doing so well. Now, Agent Navar. Jeez. You are not afraid to kill. I am pleased. The last thing I would expect from the brother of Paul. I didn't kill anybody. I'm learning as I go. You just passed lesson one. Lesson two is how we deal with the terrorists in the subway station. I'm ready. The terrorists have wired the platform with explosives and put in hostages. Get the hostages out if you can, but make sure the NSF learned that human shields will not work against you, Natko. Nothing we can't handle with a few EMP grenades. We are thinking the same thought. I will equip you with two grenades. They will disable any electronic detonators within a radius of 20 meters. If you are mean to her, she gives only one. The guy vanished. This is my method to pacifistically deal with terrorists in a subway station. If you have better methods, go ahead and use them. I would say my methods are not only very efficient, but also spare a lot of ammo. You can do this.
<laughs> yeah, once you like take more or less everyone, or at least you are done with this Cyrus, you can do this. Yeah, basically the idea is very simple. And he's running away, right? Yes, I would classify it as running away. Hey, take some patience. Your brother Paul has got an approach into another mess. Mm -hmm. You have to forgive my brother, he's not as good as we are, Anna. We are a great team. You think he's aggressive? Yeah, one of them is. Okay, we have him. That's how you rescue hostages. Last one is non-aggressive. So you just need to find him. Which is hard by the way, it's, I don't know where they hide. Fucking rats. Yeah, this is very good, especially since you re re recover hostages. You can talk to this guy. Right. I guess so. Why were they assembling the station? They were pulling out. Most of them got on the train and went north. Were they transporting any heavy supplies? Barrels? Not that I saw, but I heard them talking about a warehouse. How they needed every precious second to move some kind of shipment. Precious indeed. They just gave up a half a dozen lives for a couple of minutes. I'll be okay. Thanks. So, if I can be perfectly honest, I think that's all of them. This is absolutely pacifist, zero kills. My hands are clean. They just feel dirty. But you get used to it, using your brain. You saved my life. Yes, I'm doing it reg on a regular basis, woman. You can admire my dedication. Okay, this is a relatively hard throw. 
every throw with TNT is hard to throw. So you wanna have at least three TNTs here. Well, not here exactly. Dude, that was not good work. That was magnificent work. I get only one shot in the leg because that guy uh, should supposed to be dead against Yunatko alone. I should not have to interfere in any way. Hmm? Oh, I know, I, I sounded the alarm. And now troops are going downstairs and I hope they will not not get harm in any way. That will be very inconvenient if Thanks for your service. <gasps> Look at that! I just found augmentation canister. I'm lucky. I deserve this. You can now hack this and set turrets to attack other things than you. For example, enemies. And now this turret shoot this guy, as you can see. This turret. And this turret. What? Oh, I see, terminal is locked. Okay, I didn't know that in the doors. These are these big doors in front of you. Mm -hmm. And we can basically uh, turn on cameras. We can also save. I'm not sure how many of them are inside yet. Uh, still. Uh. I think only two are left inside. I would say I don't need to kill them, they have assault rifles or other garbage. Take him out. 
How the fuck? And he's hostile. Yeah. On top of this. Okay, that's problematic as fuck because I never... Uh, he have napalm by the way, uh, one shot I am dead. One shot anywhere, it's not like you know. We should save. Yeah, this is extremely strong weapon. You absolutely don't wanna go anywhere near flamethrowers. Your brother Paul has gotten our troops into another mess. Yeah, I understand, but... Please understand one that I cannot really, like... Replace uh, Paul in every single situation possible. Like we need to give boy some chances. Like <clears throat> and the fuck on Paul the butcher, biggest fan of murdering NFC tropes. I need his chances. Also, holy shit, don't send me more of these guys. Fuck. Go ahead, flamethrower. There is the last chest we left to open in this map, unless I'm missing one, because there might be one, one more. And sadly that's this chest. The terrorists didn't even care. They thought I was lying. Good. At <laughs> are you... Ah, I knew it. Bio, bio, bio something. Yeah, this not contain password to this. Nice. Yeah, great work overall. Passive strana. Absolutely. I wonder if you have statistic, for example. Credits, intro settings. Terrorist commander, health kitchen, colonel, special. Leo Gold. And he have contact with Lebedev and Jojo Fine. 